So what's keeping you awake tonight? My name is Devin Higgins. This little patch of internet real estate, such as it is, is my YouTube channel. Uh, it's called The Insomniac because as you can see over my shoulder, it's dark out, especially being I'm on the West Coast, so it means it's late. I really should be asleep as I have work in the morning, but for reasons yet undefined, that ain't happening tonight. So like a fair percentage of people, I have insomnia. The problem is that my type is such that my brain will fixate on an idea and it will keep churning it over and over in my head until it finally decides it's time for me to just pass out, which could be any time between now and dawn. And over the years, I've tried just about everything short of hitting myself over the head with a really, really big mallet to finally get my brain to just shut off so I can go to sleep. And yes. I have considered the mallet many times as well. So one of the other reasons why I was looking to start this channel is that I am actually a journalist. I'm a practicing journalist. My credentials in case you want to know. So because mass media as we know it is evolving at such a, an astronomical rate, I mean seriously when I started thinking about being a journalist the internet had just gotten into its infancy. We had a couple of major places you can go to online. AOL was big, Netscape was big. You didn't have YouTube, you didn't have Twitter, you didn't even have Facebook yet. But now as somebody who actually practices media and is trying to get ahead in media, I'm finding that the opportunities to actually expand what I know in media is getting very very small. How small? Well let me put it this way. In the last six months, I've applied to about 200 places across the country looking for whatever media jobs I can get. How many of them have I gotten so far? That many. And the primary amount of feedback I've gotten has been to expand my skill set, branch out into new territory, and show people what I can do in terms of multimedia production. So, here I am. So what else can I tell you about me? Hmm. This is kind of like 20 questions, except I don't have anybody to bounce them back and forth off of. The other thing I want to be able to do with this channel is bring awareness to a condition that I have that's called Charcot Marie Tooth Syndrome, or CMT. And yes, there is actually a scientist who would help discover this disease called Howard Henry Tooth. He discovered it back in 1886. Not my fault he got the name, but next time you have somebody complain about yours, Go ahead and throw that one at them and see what they say. CMT is a group of inherited disorders that affects the peripheral nervous system. They'll tell you it's a type of muscular dystrophy, although some people will tell you that it's not. But the conditions are similar enough that they fall into the same substrata. The good news is that it's a inherited genetic disorder, so it's not contagious, it's not fatal but it does impact about 3 million people worldwide annually. I found I had it about 20 years ago. I got it from my dad who got it from his mother. It runs through my family. I passed it on to my son. He'll be about three and a half here pretty soon. And what I'd like to be able to do is try and generate a little bit more of awareness about it, let folks know about it, because it's a condition that really, if you don't know what to look for, can kind of slip under the radar and you won't know that it's hitting you until you're a lot older. If you're actually interested in getting more information about CMT, what it does and who it affects, I'll put some information down in the fine print for you so you can check it out when you have some time. So for everything else I really want to talk about, it's going to be kind of a seat of the pants sort of thing, but the bottom line is I can sum it up in one word. Stuff. Nerdy stuff. Geek stuff. My stuff. And your stuff. Because I'm drawing a lot of my inspiration, as a lot of us are, from the Vlog Brothers and Becky O and everybody else who's vlogging these days, I'm going to try and keep it to a similar format. Post at least once a week, no more than four to five minutes max. And unless it's something really specific that I really want to talk about, then I may run over a little bit, but not too much. Because honestly, let's face it, we should really all be sleeping right now. So with that, welcome to my YouTube channel. Feel free to follow me on Google Plus at The Insomniac. And I suppose I will talk to you soon. Until then, do yourself a favor. Get some sleep.